Through eight games, the walleye continued to be paced by Hawk and another Falcon. Sam Craggs is tied for the team lead with 13 points on six goals and seven assists, more than halfway to matching the total production from his first 71 games in a Toledo sweater. His role has changed. His work ethic has not, so the team expects to see more of this. Craggs, Craggs fires a wrister. He scores! He won't make it sound like much. Having a full season under my belt definitely has helped, and uh, just everyone playing well around me has just helped me uh, capitalize on the opportunity. But the numbers don't lie. His team doesn't either. Right from day one, I, I've been impressed with his leadership skills and you know the way that he comes and approaches every day as a pro, and, and not, it's coming through in the games now. And then there aren't highs and lows in his games. It's a very consistent game, and, and he does things the right way and gets rewarded. And so does everyone around him. The Walleye have a plus 11 goal differential with Crags on the ice. He's not just capitalizing on opportunities. Take Saturday against Fort Wayne. Back-to-back shorthanded goals are moments that completely alter the momentum. You know, Sam being one of those players that he sets the tone in practice and, and in the game that, you know, when we need a spark, he's going to be there for us. He's a very underrated player. He has really good hockey IQ. And just seeing his leader uh, attributes come out as he's gotten older. Uh, he's great in the room, great with the younger guys. So it's, uh, it's amazing to see, and it's a uh, true blessing, honestly, to be playing with him again. Cruz would know he's been playing with Craig since they were freshmen at Bowling Green in 2017, but you don't even have to go back that far. Saturday against the Comets, the second shorty came together with on-ice awareness and scouting during the week. In a video that I was pointed out by uh, Coach Hirsch, and uh, I was looking for it at that time. They made a bad pass, and I was able to scoop it up and score. Oh, he's the guy who studies the game, and um, it takes a lot in with those all those pre-scout videos we do and stuff like that. And you know, we talk about it before we go out every time on a shift on the PK. Um, you know what their tendencies are and who's out on that ice. The hockey IQ his teammates harp on makes changing positions easier. Craggs is playing center for the first time since he was 12 years old. I mean, a lot of teams run uh, like first forward back is the low guy. That's usually the centerman's position. So you, you find yourself. Uh, in that position as a winger time to time. And changing to center makes it easier to keep doing this. He scores! I think it's freed him up a little bit offensively that way as well. So it's, uh, you, you don't ever want to put uh, goals on the players early in the season on we need him to do this or uh, this player to do that. So it's just great to see him, you know, living up to expectations and then taking a step and raising his level of his game.